Hey, welcome back to Eat, Learn, Love. Thanks for joining me again. I'm gonna do a grocery haul video real quick. It's gonna be super fast because it's lunchtime and kids are hungry. I'm starving too. We did Sam's Club and Meyer, and then we ran in Dollar Tree for like three items. But uh, I'm not even gonna do Dollar Tree because it wasn't grocery budget related. But anyways, I will start with Meyer and then I'll run through Sam's and then I'll give you our meals for the week that we plan to use all this food. Okay, first up at Meyer, I just got this creamer. This is the one we like, the almond milk creamer. It was not on sale. I think it was three dollars or three nineteen or something. Um, the strawberries were on sale for dollar seventy nine for one pound or three twenty nine for two pounds. So I got a two pound because that was a better deal, and then a one pound because I was gonna get three one pounds. But so we do that. We eat a decent amount of strawberries. I probably could have gotten two two pounds, but I didn't want to get crazy and then worry about them. These eggs are a dollar nineteen a dozen at Meyer. Um, they're like the value dozen. I got five, so it's about six bucks. This chicken was $1.99 a pound, but I had a coupon for $1.25 off any chicken breast purchase. So I actually got this for $8.20. Um, bleach for my whites, just running low on that. Milk was $2.09, I think these were. It was way cheaper than what I thought it was gonna be. Let me see, milk, milk. Mm -mm. Milk, why can't I find it? Oh, $2.09, yeah. Um, I think at Sam's they were going to be two thirty two, so I just got them at Meyer two hundred nine. Kerry Gold was on sale for three dollars. I just needed one. We needed some unsalted butter, and these were two seventy nine each, so it was a better deal to just get the two rather than the big four pack at Sam's. Cottage cheese, I just some of the kids like to eat it, and then I'm going to hopefully be making honey wheat bread um, this week or next week. Green peppers were seventy nine cents each, and then I had a digital coupon through my M perks for buy two get one free, so I did that. My youngest daughter needed a new brush. We needed some floss. These were a dollar each. The silk uh, protein milk was $2.99 on sale. It's only 20 cents off the regular price, but it's still pretty good. Um, almond milk is $2.29 regular price. So we just got two of those. So my total at Meyer was $63.97 and I used, uh, I think my total savings today was $19.83 with coupons and um, sale prices. So we'll run over and see what we got at Sam's. Um, just some basic things we needed, not a whole lot. I needed cinnamon, so I just got the giant one. We make our oatmeal packets with this, and uh, this was $7.98. The bananas were $1.24 for the bunches, the three pounds, so I just got two. The grapes, I think, were, what were they, four something? Three something, Four thirty-two for um, three pounds of grapes, so that wasn't too bad of a dollar. Dollar forty something, um, so not bad at all. And then these were, I think, nine dollars. Um, granola bars. Where are they? Eight ninety eight. So yeah, just about nine bucks. This is twelve forty six. The eighteen cups of the Oikos. This is the one my husband and I like, and some of the kids do like them now too. The Folgers was not on sale. It's eight something, eight ninety eight maybe, or eight ninety two. Not the best price, but we is the cars individual bags. I could have made this. I thought about this after the fact. It's just peanuts and sunflower kernels, like pretend M&Ms and raisins. And I could have made it, but I didn't really want to buy all the individual ingredients and I didn't really have any others on hand. So I just got these for now. These are for the kids that take the different volleyball games and things. This is the protein bars that I put in my husband's lunch and some of the kids like them uh, with breakfast. These were on sale for ten sixty six, I believe. I think it was three dollars off. So um, let me see here. Yes, it was three dollars off on the Nutrigrain protein bars. Um, oats. <laughs> we get ten pounds of the quick oats. This is what I make up our oatmeal bags with. It's this brown sugar and cinnamon. Um, and so I want to make a whole bunch this week. So I got this. Um, I made about 15 last week, and they blow through those so fast. So, uh, we got the big box. Here are five avocados. It was, I think, five thirty-three for the bag of five. Not the best price, but that's still about a dollar six um, each. So that's still better than the dollar forty-nine that a lot of places I'm seeing right now have as a sale price for avocados. The honey. Um, I, this is not my favorite. I am disappointed that it's a product of US and Canada. Like, why do we need? It was normally 12 something and then there was a uh, dollar off this month. So it was 11.28, I believe. 
I got the five pounds of pink lady apples. It was seven sixty two or something like that. And that worked out to a better per pound price than at Meyer. At Meyer, I think they were, um, well, I don't remember. It was three pounds for like five forty nine. So this was definitely a better deal here. Um, then we have mild cheddar cheese slices. This is for sandwiches. Um, and then I got these for the kids. So they ran out of their probiotics. And since I was there, I just got these. There's 150, but they take two each. So five kids, two gummies each. This is only gonna last them 15 days. <laughs> Big family problems. Um, honey roasted turkey breast. This is, I really like this particular lunch meat. And so I've just been getting this each week and I just like to put it with some cheese. I don't, I'm not a huge fan of sandwiches lately. So I've just been pairing those up and rolling them and eating them. I got this for the kids, the honey wheat Sara Lee. Just, it looks like yummy and a good price. I think it was three forty eight or three twenty eight. Um, a three pack of cucumbers is two fifty five. They have the barbecued chips. They are gluten free. Both both of them are gluten free. I think this was three dollars and that was six dollars. So my total and oh wait, one other item. I got thirty two rolls of quilted northern. I don't normally buy quilted northern. However, the forty five rolls of the members mark uh, brand was out, and so like completely out. Um, I checked around to see if there was a special display even, and there wasn't. So that was the next best in price. It was only a dollar more, but you got 13 fewer rolls. So I was pretty irritated, and I think a lot of people in the aisle were very confused as to why they were completely wiped out of all members marked toilet paper. But anyways, my total there was 166.92. Um, so not bad. So together it was 166 and so we'll say 167 and 64 so it came out to about 230 231 uh total of my 263 budget so 263 in my budget and then i spent about 230 in groceries so i have 33 left over in case we find any odds and ends we need i'm also gonna use some of that grocery budget money to get into my daughter's volleyball game tonight um and then i'll run through the meals we're gonna do it real quick sorry gotta walk over here um, this week we're going to be having, um, chicken fried rice and also, uh, griddled shrimp. We're going to have pizza one night. I have those in the freezer already. Uh, we had pork tacos last night. Sorry, that was on my menu for this week, but I didn't shop till today. Um, pulled pork sandwiches. That's going to be barbecue pulled pork. I have that, the two pound pulled pork container from Sam's in the, or Sam's or Costco, one or the other, in the fridge already. So we'll just add the sauce to it and warm it up. And I think I'll save that for next week when we have another game so we can come home and just warm it up and eat it. We're gonna do breakfast for dinner one night, eggs, bacon, um, maybe pancakes. Um, what else? Oh, hash browns. I was gonna, I have some potatoes. I'll just do like fried potato chunks. Um, tonight we're gonna have chicken sausage cut up and mix in with some gluten-free noodles. And then we put cheese, um, Parmesan cheese on it. And then one day this weekend, we will be at a friend's house. So those are our meals. Pretty simple, pretty basic. I didn't have to buy, I really didn't need to buy any meat this week, but I wanted to get the chicken breasts because I want to cook them up and shred them and have them ready for some meals for next week. Lunches this week will just be leftovers or lunch meat sandwiches. We have some pizza rolls for the kids in the freezer. Nachos, I already have all the ingredients for that. And then just snacky stuff, which could be leftovers, could be, you know, cheese, crackers, that kind of thing. Breakfast this week are the oatmeal bags that I was talking about. Um, baked oatmeal. I have one in the freezer. I think it's banana and chocolate chip. I'm going to make a couple more. Uh, pancakes. We have some in the freezer. And then I still have some of that giant bag of Krusty's pancake mix. Um, and those are just for the kids. I, my husband and I don't really eat the pancakes. Um, waffles. We have a couple packages of the boxes of Eggo waffles I bought when they were on sale at Costco. And I think there's 12 in each package, and that's about one package will be one breakfast. And then egg cups. I want to make some more egg cups. Uh, we have a couple in the fridge. I didn't buy... Oh, there's a fly. I didn't buy any more sausage, so we'll have to see if I can do some with bacon or maybe just do them meatless and just do cheese and spinach or something. But that's it. So thanks for watching. Um, sorry I had to do that really fast. We got to get eaten and get going. The girls have a game today. My husband's off this week, so we're trying to get a bunch of things done around the house. And it's just been chaos. I feel like I say that every single time, expecting it to be different the next time, but it's still just busy. So thanks for watching. If you like these, hit like, hit subscribe. Sorry, I'm shaking. Hit the um, little bell so you can get a notification whenever we have a new video. 
and I have some other homeschool videos planned and lined up. And then I have, um, oh, we've changed up our changed up our laundry routine, like revamped it since the last time I made a video. And so I knew as soon as I made that video, I'd have to like redo it because we were gonna change it. But something new and cool and it's easier for what we're doing right now. And again, it'll, it may change in the next few months, but I'll share that soon in a video as well. And I'm just gonna get all this stuff put away so we can eat. Have a good week, stay cool. It's 80s here still this week. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.